He's pushing the Pepinol players back, and I have no idea. It must have been called over by the touch judges, he's shown. I'm baffled here. What's the signal going to be? It's going to be another free kick, I think. Not back 10. Not 10, yeah. yeah. So they'll tap and go again. Richards goes right, and it's to Leguizamon. Leguizamon drives in and goes to ground just on the edge of what we can see is the football penalty box. They move it right once more to Cat. Crash ball for Mapasua. Half through, just hauled down about seven metres short. Irish are close to the Perpignan line. They really need to come away from here with some points. Richards picks up and dummies and is driven back and drops I the know, ball. I think, it's, I think it's a penalty against the London Irish here. Well, the referee has blown, and now there's a bit of a scrap breaking out on the floor, which uh, is between Peter Richards and a Frenchman. Surprisingly. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll work out what the upshot is. I actually think it may, be, may even be a penalty to London Irish and, and even a Simbining for yeah, Perpignan, I'm hoping, anyway. Well, he had his hand in his pocket briefly. I don't know if Mr Changling's hands, maybe they're just cold, and he might theatrically pull out a handkerchief like we saw here. I think it's Sean David did that a few weeks ago in the EDF Cup, but... Uh, well, we'll see what happens here. And there's a lecture for both captains now. Casey and, uh, well, in fact, it's Alvarez who's been called over. Perry Freshwaters comes over as well. And, um, well, what will the upshot of all of this be? I think we're hoping for an Irish penalty. And uh, it would suggest that, the body language, and the, the given as well, that there's uh, an extra pep in your player there. Here comes the yellow, I think. Yeah, it's yep. Alvarez who's going. Is Casey going as well, though? No, it's just Alvarez. Sorry, for a horrible moment then, I thought Casey was about to turn and go too. But well, Alvarez is making way, and it will be a penalty to London Irish, which I'm quite sure, certain, that London Irish will now go for the catch and drive. If they do, they've, they've, they've got to come away with a try. Nothing less is enough here after taking three penalties. They, they, need, the, they need the try here for certain. Well, Kat's looking towards that uh, left-hand corner, and uh, so we were calling for the yellow card, and at last it's come Rimas Alvarez, the uh, Argentinian. We played in the World Cup with the likes of TAC and Leguizamon. He's actually uh, half Lithuanian, I was reading, which is a bizarre mix. But anyway, that matters not. It's a line out to London Irish, five metres out. The London Irish forwards get together. The brain stress has a chat to decide what the uh, outcome will be. It'll be a throw coming up from David Pace. The call has been decided upon. The big moment in this game, you feel. We've played 20 minutes of this second half. David Pace with the throw. He goes to the middle. Kate, uh, up goes Kennedy and makes the catch. And here comes the try from same Irish. Move again. It's exactly the same move, but Perpignan pushed them this time towards the right-hand touch on Irish. Move it infield and drive. They're only a metre short, but Perpignan holding third is a try. penalty try. Well, goodness me. Mr Changling, I take it all back. He's given a penalty try to London Irish. Under the post he come. Pulling right. down the mall. Must have been Great under the post. Great there from Changling. <laughs> yeah, wouldn't have a bad word said against him, Shane. Not at all. <laughs> so a penalty try for London Irish to level it up. Right on the hour mark at uh, 16 all, and uh, I think it's safe to say it'll be 18 16 because, uh, well, it's and, another yellow card. card. <laughs> well, it gets better. It's like he's handing out Christmas cards, the reaction it's all of the crowd. Off. <laughs> well, they're down to 13, and uh, this is going to be a huge nine minutes or so for London Irish. They've got Perpignan on the ropes, perhaps. They're down to 13, and they're about to go two points ahead. Well, goodness me. I said earlier he's consistently making consistently odd decisions both ways. Well, he's just played a blinder for London Irish in the last two minutes. He has. <laughs> well, uh, a rather surprised and uh, slightly jubilant Medeski Stadium is. Hewitt hammers it through. Will he hand out any more cards? Every time he puts his hand in his pocket now, we'll be expecting another card.